Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today, from Salads and Sandwiches of 1917, we're going to be making the banana sandwich. Now, in 1917, Jeanette Rankin of Montana became the first woman elected to the House of Representatives here in the United States. Uh, the Chattanooga Bakery in Tennessee introduced the moon pie, and uh, jazz legend Ella Fitzgerald was born. Okay, the first thing we have to do is to thinly slice bananas. And yeah, I went lengthwise instead of crosswise. I don't know why. It didn't specify. Got to sprinkle it with sugar and lemon juice. Then onto buttered thinly sliced bread. Going thin, took a regular slice and cut it in half using my magic device. Ground peanuts. Roasted peanuts, didn't say salted, so I got roasted unsalted. And no, it didn't say how much. And on top of that, we put our bananas. Okay, let's give this quite dainty banana sandwich a go. Peanuts, banana, lemon, sugar, and butter. That's actually quite nice. I do want to post it up with one thing though. I'm gonna add a little pumpkin pie spice mix. I think that's gonna go really nicely here. Okay, let's give this banana sandwich plussed up with a little pumpkin pie spice. A go. Oh, it's nice. So it's got cinnamon, nutmeg, cloves, allspice. All of them are working really well with the peanuts, working really well with the banana, the lemon, uh, and the butter. Well, clearly this is meant as some sort of a tea sandwich or a snack sandwich. It's not something that you'd have for lunch. And in that category, I would say that the original banana sandwich was quite lovely. I'm gonna give that a seven. Plussed up with the pumpkin pie spice mix, that's an eight. That is really nice. A lot of warm spices and complex flavors that would go really well with everything in there. The banana, the lemon juice, the butter. Um, it is tasty. I am going to finish that and I would make this again. Absolutely. Especially the plussed up one. <laughs> All right. See you tomorrow.